What is up here, YouTube? Jigsaw0097 here today, guys. And the Eagles have just laid a 50 burger on the Denver Broncos in Philadelphia wearing the black uniforms. The black uniforms are now officially just good karma. Every single time the Eagles wear these jerseys, they dominate teams. Oh, and uh, if there was any doubt, guys, I'm saying it now. If there was any doubt that this team is for real, I feel like it has been erased today um, in Philadelphia, in Lincoln Financial Field. Zach Ertz was out of the game, and the Eagles still just showed up and made it look like they didn't even need him. This team is just so stacked on so many levels. Jay Ajayi makes his debut as an Eagle and gets a touchdown. He hasn't made a single touchdown all year with the Miami Dolphins, and he gets one with the Philadelphia Eagles today. It was amazing to watch, guys. Um, I mean, what more can be said at this point, really? Let's let's be honest. What more can be said? Carson Wentz looks like a stud. Um, Alshon Jeffrey and Carson Wentz are starting to get that connection going, finally, at the perfect time in the year. LeGarrette Blunt is a beast. Uh, Jay Ajayi is a beast. Nelson Aguilar continues to catch the ball. He's not dropping it. Um, our defense is dominant every game. They play for 60 minutes. Um, there's just what more is to be said. I mean, this team is just... This team is ready to go. I really am looking at the league now, and none of these teams scare me anymore, guys. I mean, I, I'm not trying to be arrogant. This is just facts. The Eagles are that legit this year. Um, it's insane. I have not seen a team this dominant since, like, the Don McNabb days. So, this is crazy. Um... But yeah, some takeaways from the game. Um, the Denver Broncos, we already knew that they were kind of limping into this game. But I expected them to put up more of a fight than this. Um, Von Miller, I knew that he would eat his words. He said that he guaranteed a win against the Eagles, which I knew was a bunch of crap. Um, but I didn't expect them to come in and just take a crap on the field like they have. I mean, the Eagles put up a 50-burger. I haven't seen a 50-burger since, like... We played the Bears in 2013. I think that was the last time I saw once a game like that. But, um, yeah, the Eagles, they just they hit on all cylinders, guys. I mean, I really don't know what else to say. The Eagles just dominated this. So I'm just kind of making this quick video as my reaction to that. Um, the Eagles lay a 50-burger on the Denver Broncos. They've shown the league that we are legit. They moved to 8-1, and one, guys, on the year. We have the bye week. To get ready to play our division rival Dallas, the most hated division rival, which it looks like they're winning in Kansas City right now. So um, they're going to keep making it interesting, but I mean, they don't scare me, guys. Dallas does not scare me in the slightest. So bring it on. We want Dallas. Eight and one, Eagles fans. Remember that. Eight and one. Enjoy this week. Go to all those people that doubted you, that talked crap on the Eagles, and just just laugh. Walk with pride and just laugh because you are a fan of the Philadelphia Eagles. This has been Jigsaw0097, and I will talk to you all later.